exciting that stage of the game was the you know, pretty tight game? And uh, I mean, just try to hold the lead or improve it. Obviously, um, you know, the bench been trying to support the start as much as we can and with different scheme and all that. So I think everybody was focusing on that and trying to get the rebounds and the loose balls and trying to trying to do something to, to help the, the team, obviously. The, um, like you, you haven't been taking a lot of threes lately, but yeah. you know, percentages are kind of creeping up the last few weeks. Mm -hmm. so what's, the, what's the story? Uh, just trying to do the right play, obviously. Um, take the open ones. Um, we got a lot of shooters on this team. We got a lot of guys that could score, so I'm just trying to find my role in there. And um, obviously, um, I really always thought that I was a good shooter, so especially when I take the open one. So I'm just trying to take the open one, not shoot the ball too much, and focus on the right things. How are you feeling um, overall about the offense? Kind of the, the way you're feeling consistently here? I mean, ups and down. I think we're getting better. We're finding the open guys and stuff. Um, we're definitely best shooting the ball a lot better than when we started at the beginning of the year and all, and that's always a good sign. Um, but like I said, um, you know, we just got to find a way to put a whole game together defensively and offensively. And usually when we do that, we're good. Like I said, we, we, just, we had laps where we were playing really good, and it shows. And the times that we didn't, then they, they made us pay for it. That first half. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I'm always give credit to the opponent. You know, they they're a tough team, and um, they got uh, guys that play hard. They, they were they were pretty keyed, and I thought we just started a little sloppy, a little loose, and um, some of those were unforced, uncharacteristic. Um, just didn't have that same punch right from the get go. Um, worked ourselves into it, but to, you know, we finished with a 13, so uh, we were able to to get that under control. But definitely, way too many in the first half. Okay, so, so you guys had a, a, a great third quarter. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, they were scoring. You know what I mean. I, I'm always on the opposite end of that. You know what I mean. I don't know how many um, fourth quarter shootouts you see. Uh, you know, from us these days. So we get some stops. We're in good shape there. But um, you know, we dries up. They don't dry up. You know, it's it's tough. So they threw threw some sh shots in that um, you know we needed to miss and. Um, Got some good looks offensively. I know I certainly had a lot of good looks late, uh, created, generated some good shots. Um, so, you know, that's, you know, that'll hurt, you know, tonight when you go to sleep. But uh, we fought hard, we competed, um, but give them credit. They, they outplayed us there the last six minutes to win the game. Does it feel in general like the offense is in a better place than it was a month ago? Yeah, I think so. I think just in general, everything we're doing just feels better. You know, I think that we're competing at a high level. Um, execution is, you know, hit or miss sometimes. Uh, can get a little smarter and a little more keyed in and consistent. But we've been competing. We've been together. We've been communicating. And uh, we've been getting better and growing as a team. So uh, you got to be able to take the positives out of some of these situations and um, just keep building. Obviously, you'd like to win and, and um, learn while winning. But um, it doesn't always go that way. So. Uh, you know, we got we got some games here left in this just road trip we got to get, and um, you know we'll be able to go back home um, feeling good about ourselves if we we can take care of business going forward. Fred, you just talked about growing as a team, and you know you guys are two and two on the road, so you're over the hump of all the games and all you've gone through in the last. What does success results aside look like for this team right now? I think every win we need every win we can get. You know, it's just crunch time. It's not really um, you know time for us to be you know trying to take more victories um, we need real victories we need to get in the win columns we need to stack these wins and um, just take it one day at a time uh, like I said just continue to get better and um, just you know grow every day and um, stack those days on top of days but we need the wins too so um, we got to be able to lock in and get a couple of these wins and give ourselves a chance going down the stretch guys uh, certainly yourself in a position to win the game and see if you get a couple of Plays made down the stretch, whether it's a ball three and then the offensive rebound. Did you get sort of worn out by that time? Or? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think so. I think, I think um, you're right. We were right there. I really liked it, even in one of the last timeouts. I thought we were down three with 
I don't know, seven to go or something. And I was like, I really liked the feel of the game. I thought we were um, doing a lot of good things at both ends. And um, and I just, again, I didn't think it bounced our way very good. I mean, we do get end up getting hurt on, a, on, on two or three offensive rebounds down the stretch for two of them for threes. And it's too bad. I mean, I, I really had a good look on one of them. And there was just a collision. Like Malachi was right there for that long rebound, and he, he turned around and ran right into like Wayne Wright just wiped him out of the play, and it bounced right to Lee, and he and he and he nailed it. And then the last one was the same, really long rebound, right? You know, right right out to Paul. Um, and then we had a chance again. We had a pretty good look at a three to tie it right right back there. Um, went goes in and out. Um, so again, I think we were playing really hard, playing really well. Obviously, could have done a few things and shored up the rebounding, but just didn't really bounce our way there when we really needed it to. And and there was again, I give them credit; they made a lot of hustle plays. You know, they they threw in a lot of stuff that the ball was loose and tipped and knocked away, and they you know scoop it up and throw in a bank shot or whatever. But they did make some big baskets down the stretch, especially Bridges when he when they needed them. He made a couple pull up jumpers to kind of keep them rolling. Again, with your shot, like fifty percent, made eleven threes. The offense seems to be really clicking along. Do you like what you're seeing start to finish in the middle? The turnovers in the first half field. Like yeah, really uncharacteristic, especially to start the game for us. I think we had 11 at the half. Like, that's a game's worth for us. And, and again, we do a much better job in the second half there. Um, I didn't. I did love the way we started offensively. I thought, again, obviously the turnovers, I thought we were a little stagnant. But we certainly picked that up. We started cutting and free in space and making a few dump offs and kick offs, uh, kick outs, et cetera. Um, after kind of a, about a six, seven minute start where I didn't think it was very good. With the turnovers, I mean, it seemed, you know, like they were pretty long at times, which is the same problem you get with other teams. Yeah, yeah. Uh, was there anything specific that you saw causing them? No, you know what? I just thought. There was some physicality involved in, in a lot of them. You know, we, we were we were taking some bumps and, and some lots of lots of active hands and we just, you know, you gotta you gotta get through some of that stuff, right? You can't let the bump jar the ball loose. You can't let the, the, the secondary defender reach in and, and strip you. You know, even if he's getting part of your arm, you still gotta play through that, right? I, I, I did think it was physical. I thought we had a lot of collisions out there both ways, right? Um I thought we got it. We got a. We didn't really get our share of those collisions, right? Like there was six loose ball fouls in the second half, all on us. There was a bunch of collisions where we were offensive fouls on us, and you know, I, and then Scotty got collided in that break. You know, again, just end up turning it over. But it was, it was. Um, we needed to play through that stuff, and we weren't able to. Offense doesn't seem like it's coming super easily to Pascal right now. Few last few games, anything you're concerned about, or just figure out. Well, there certainly is going to see um, a lot of people, a lot of def good defenders, and a lot of a lot of a lot of action. You know, my my thing is is continue to create offense, not necessarily shots. Like, you know, play on the catch, make a quick decision. There's bodies on you. You got to get off it, right? That's my main concern, and um, uh, that will I think ease uh, things up for him a little bit. I just think again, you just got to make the right play. Period. He got hit hard too, a lot. I thought on a lot of his turns he was getting blasted. He didn't, didn't, you know, didn't get to the free throw line nearly enough. I thought because he was in there tough. Go ahead. Um, Brad was talking about uh, kind of like the shift of not doing so great, but then finding it, um, and then abandoning the thought of letting it come to you and going after it. Uh, where do you lean on that with Pascal in terms of getting back? To well, I think again, like each night presents its its um, own situation, right? And I just think that for both those guys, there, there's nights when you got to see what the coverages look like. You kind of got to you kind of got to go out there and let the feel the game out a little bit, see what's happening, see how they're defending you, and see if there's any adjustments you need need to make in between that, right? So, so you know, there's 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 certain coverages and things that those guys are gonna get freed up more. For shots, and there's certain ones they're not, and one, and again, you just got to continue to make the right plays and and get it get it to where it needs to go. How do you feel about the performance tonight? Um, I mean, it was okay, right? It was okay. I thought they bought us some some decent minutes uh, here and there. Um, 
you know, I thought Chris had moments, Thad had moments, you know, certainly Malachi. I thought, you know, even Christian played a few good minutes there to end the half. Malachi certainly came in and, and, and made a couple shots, which were, were much needed, right, that were, were keeping us afloat a little bit. Um, I mean, the plus minus isn't great there for a lot of those guys, but I didn't think it was too bad. You guys seem to be, back to the physical stuff, seem to be play tougher. I thought we were playing really tough. I thought we were just getting we were just getting the wrong end of some of that. I mean, you know, we're just physically blocking out and they're going flying and and we were I just thought we especially in the second half. You know, like every time there was a loose ball foul, it was it was it, it just wasn't I mean, I'm I, we're going to keep blocking out hard, right? And we, yeah, we, we yep. I think so. Yeah. I mean, the ones that got us were the long ones. I mean, there was there was a few around the basket, but the ones that got us are the long ones and and um you know, we do have to pursue the ball a little better. You know, got to, got to, somebody's got to anticipate where that thing's bouncing to, and and go run, run some of those down.